from growing up playing against each other in the backyard to playing with each other one last time in high school, this set of triplets capped off their senior season in historic fashion. Let's meet our athletes of the week. The Gullivan Triplets. I'm Kaylee Fagerstrom. I'm Ethan Fagerstrom. I'm Madison Fagerstrom. They're often told they don't look the same, but they share the same name and the same game that led their school to their first mixed six state volleyball championship in nearly 20 years. More emotional before the triumphant victory than after, knowing it was their last time stepping on the court together. I realize it was my last high school game. <laughs> and how did it feel, you know, to see him be so emotional? It just, it, it hurts, but at the, I don't know, because he's our brother, and it hurts to see our siblings cry. I don't know, I think it's just the best feeling playing with a team, especially with your siblings. As they've been inseparable since roughhousing in the living room. Oh. They used to beat me up until I started... <laughs> Until I started wrestling, then they stopped messing with me. I can still get them. No, you can't. Yes, I can. Fun time playing, even though we get mad at each other a lot. <laughs> Capping off their careers with a championship for their community and their family. It feels good to bring a title back home again after how long. And I'm, not, I'm just proud. Proud to bring it back home, make our community proud. and have bragging rights over my siblings, <laughs> besides Corey, because he's our last sibling to win. It's good. It's, I'm proud of us. I'm proud of all of us. The Gullivan Triplets. One, two, three, triple threat! <laughs> Ethan didn't quite get the memo there, but for the rest of the winter, we do expect to see the triplets on the basketball court for Gullivan before graduating from Martin L. Olson School in the spring.